The left will do anything to stop the Kavanaugh vote. They are fueled by blind desperation. Now, the so-called high school accuser has come forward, claiming she has proof of the attack, citing therapist notes from 2012, where she told her therapist about the Kavanaugh attack, and the media and the Democrats are running with this story, creating a wild frenzy. But wait, there are some very, very big problems with her story, starting with the fact that the therapist notes never mention Judge Kavanaugh, and claim that four boys attacked her, while the accuser claims it was two. She says the therapist notes are wrong, good grief. Liberals are so godless and cruel, and desperate to retain power, that they will shamelessly and falsely smear a good man's name and reputation without blinking an eye. Breitbart The Post obtained the therapist's notes, although, the notes did not mention Kavanaugh. The records mention that she was attacked by students from an elitist boys' school who went on to become highly respected and high-ranking members of society in Washington. The notes claim that there were four boys involved, instead of just Ford and Kavanaugh. However, Ford claims that is an error on the therapist's part. The accuser says that there were four boys at the party, but only Ford and Kavanaugh in the room. Ford is represented by Deborah Katz, a liberal Democrat activist lawyer who has publicly touted that she is part of the resistance to President Trump and his agenda. Ford has also donated to Senator Bernie Sanders' IVT 2016 presidential campaign. 